Hello, welcome back to Chris's Beer Reviews. It's time for a beer review and we're reviewing the Beer Moretti Sao de Mer. That probably sounded more French than Italian. <laughs> uh, so this is Beer Moretti, but we've uh, added salt. Added salt. Who wants salt in their, in their lager? If I want salt in my lager, I'll have some uh, salted peanuts. Um, but there you go, it's something different. Uh, please don't think this is Italian, because it isn't. It's brewed in the UK. I think the Italian version has a higher ABV, as per the norm. Uh, I am a bit tired of all this. Beers that being labelled Spanish and Italian when they're, they're nothing, they're nowhere near the original. Cruz Campo being such a good example, that is an absolutely dreadful beer, Cruz Campo. Uh, but it's sold as being Spanish and we all know it isn't, brewed in the UK. So this is uh, owned by Heineken and brewed in the UK. So not, not Italian in any shape or form. Anyway, it's available in Tesco's. And it also comes with this free glass if you buy a four pack. I didn't buy this, this was a gift from uh, my two really good friends, Vicky and Caitlin, so thank you very much for thinking of me. They know I have quite an extensive glass collection, so if they see glasses that I might like, they always message me and say, would you like it? And they bought that for me. It's not gonna change the way I reviewed a beer. <laughs> um, this glass is very pretty, I must say. I've got the normal beer and Moretti glasses, but this one is quite pretty. And I have cleaned it before I start pouring, when I pour the beer in, don't think, oh my God, he hasn't cleaned the glass. I cleaned it, I just put it back in the box. So you could see the lovely presentation box that it comes in. But that is a lovely, lovely glass. Look at that. Really nice glass indeed. So let's move the four pack out of the way. I think uh, they said it was six pounds for the four pack and the glass, which if you look at it that way, that's not bad. Yeah, I mean, you could pay a five for a glass on its own, so that's not too bad. There it is in the bottle, 330ml, coming in at 4.8% ABV. I've done enough talking, but let's get on with having a look. Do I expect this to be good? No. Um, normal beer and Moretti isn't particularly fantastic, but you never know, this could surprise me. It's allegedly unfiltered. So we'll see about that. I have just cleaned this glass. Obviously, it didn't dry it properly. There we go. Um, put that there. There. Um, allegedly unfiltered. Really? I think their um, filtration system has some holes in it. That, that's clear. There's probably the tiniest amount of haze, but yeah, that's not that's not unfiltered, is it? Right, so the filtration system's got some rather large holes in it. Anyway, or not got, what am I trying to say? Yeah, big holes, it's going straight through. It's not being filtered. You know what I mean. Anyway, let's have a look on the aromas. Now well, there you go, it just smells of beer and Moretti, generic. A little bit of citrus at a push. Oh, but really generic, really generic lagery smelling. Perhaps get my face in there. Yeah, it's very generic. It's, let's taste it. Cheers, and thanks again, Vicky and Caitlin. Must appreciate it. I do appreciate the glass. It's wet. So there is a tiny, and I, and I mean tiny, perhaps they filtered the salt out. A tiny bit of salt at the back, but very, very tiny. Um, it's relatively clean. The mouthfeel's not bad. Metallic-y bitter aftertaste along with that salt which that salt is tiny. It's just, it's beer and Moretti that they're just trying to jazz up. Please people, if, if you drink macros, and, and that's all cool, if you drink macro lagers and that's all you drink and you do drink normal beer and Moretti, if this is any more expensive, don't waste your money. Uh, if you drink beer and Moretti and you enjoy it, happy days, maybe you might enjoy this, but 
th there's not a lot of difference. It's just another typical Heineken mass produced <sighs> lager that's made to look Italian when we all know it isn't. You might as well just drink normal Heineken, really. Uh, was I biased before this, before even putting it in my gob? Yes, I'll admit that. But I was hoping it might surprise me. It just hasn't. No, no, no. Um, <clears throat> if I had friends round and it was a hot day, we were having a barbecue and I really didn't want to think about what I was drinking, I'd knock them back, <clears throat> but I wouldn't buy them in the first place. Um, if I just wanted something quick to drink, I'd knock them back, but I wouldn't be buying them, so I wouldn't have them. But if someone brought them round and said, drink these, I'd, I'd drink them. If I didn't want to think about what I was drinking, at a push. Um, <clears throat> There you go, Bira Moretti, Sao de Marie, Omer, unfiltered premium lager. It's not unfiltered, it's not a premium lager. With a hint of Italian sea salt, it's the tiniest amount of sea salt, whether it's even Italian sea salt, who knows. Um, right at the back, uh, there you go, I'm done. I'm absolutely done. Bye.